There's this beautiful little resort town called Park City, Utah. I moved to Park City from California 16 years ago and just recently started offering guided group bike tours of the city and the surrounding areas. In May of 2020, I hosted my second Bicycle Touring Pro Bikes and Burritos Overnight Bicycle Tour in Park City, Utah, and we had a great group of people from all across North America come out for the tour. We cycled from Old Town Park City down Main Street and past all the old historic buildings. This is probably my favorite part of the entire bike tour because we get to learn about the history of Park City, Utah, which started as a silver mining town and has transitioned over the years into one of the best ski resorts on the entire planet. After cycling through downtown Park City, we continued our bike tour through Park City Mountain Resort, the largest ski resort in North America, into Kimball Junction, the newer, more modern side of Park City, and on to Jeremy Ranch, where we enjoyed the green grass views alongside the neighborhood's beautiful golf course. Then, about halfway through the day, we jumped on a dirt road where the scenery changed entirely, and it was a nine mile bike ride before reaching our home for the night, Big Rock Campground, situated on the south side of Echo State Park. Once in camp, we quickly chowed down on our burrito dinner, set up our tents, and spent the rest of the evening sitting around the campfire and getting to know the other people in our group. What's your name and where are you from? Uh, my name is Matt Jordan, I'm from Park City, Utah. And why did you decide to join this bike tour? Well, this one's a warm up for to, to shake out the bike and get everything checked out before I do a longer trip this summer. And what's uh, the summer trip? Uh, June 5th, I leave for uh, London and I'm biking to the coast and then take a ship across and biking all the way down through France and Spain to Lisbon, Portugal. That's awesome. So it's it's going to be a big trip. I realize I've got a lot of getting <laughs> in shape to do. And, and tell me about your bike. Um, this is a Van Nicholas uh, Deveron. It's a it's a titanium bike. Um, you think that would mean it would be light? <laughs> that that would be uh, wrong. <laughs> it's actually uh, it's about uh, 16 and a half kilos um, without the bags on it. Okay. Uh -huh. It's got a pinion uh, gearbox, 18 speed pinion gearbox yeah. with a belt drive, so you don't ever have to you know, mess around with keeping the chain grease. You don't have to worry about the dusty roads like we've been on. So that's kind of handy, and that's it's first time I've done it. It's a fairly new bike. Um, I just wanted to give it a try. My last tours I've done on on verted mountain bikes, and I'd try a dedicated touring bike. Cool. Well, we're happy you came. Thanks. Yeah. In the morning, breakfast was served. Uh, my name is Mike Silvey, and uh, I'm from Southern California, uh, Ranch Cucamonga, to be <laughs> precise. Um, I'm 61, uh, soon to be 62, and retired. But why did you decide to join this trip? 
you know, really it was to meet you and uh, I've, I've really enjoyed all your videos and, you know, it's funny because we, the participants, feel like we know you and you don't know us from Adam. <laughs> And so it was really nice, a nice group. You really had a good group of guys. And you have a commotion bicycle. I do, which was influenced by you. My previous bike was a Bob Jackson uh, English bike, uh, but it had 10,000 miles on it. You know, it was, and it was bent up from airplane trips and UPS shipping, and it, it was time for a new bike. And why not get the best? And so that's the commotion divide. That's, that's the divide, the 29er. Um, very similar to yours. I, I did upgrade with the uh, the hub and uh, headlight. Yeah. It seems like no matter how you plan a trip, that last hour is in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> so I got that and uh, I just love the whole pinion gearbox thing. Cool. And where do you want to ride? What? So I have a trip planned in September to do the Camino. Uh, um, in Portugal? In, well, actually, from we're going to do the French Spain. one. We're going to oh, start okay. in, uh, in St. John de Port uh -huh. and uh, ride to, uh, through Spain. Through Spain. Yeah. And so, yeah, looking forward to that. That's in September, and we're going to take a whole month. Cool. So it's That's kind of awesome. My, my introduction to retirement. Yeah, yeah. But well, I'm glad. Yeah, I want to thank you. This was great. You really uh -huh. put on a nice nice expedition. Thanks. I'm glad you came out. I, oh, I'm so glad I did too. It's, I mean, it's a beautiful country. Yeah. The city's gorgeous. Um, so, uh, yeah, it was, it was a fun time. Then, we packed up our bicycles and cycled back into downtown Park City where the bike tour had begun no more than 24 hours before. I've been running these Bikes and Burritos overnight bicycle tours in California and in Utah for more than five years now. And one of the things that I like so much about these specific tours is the sorts of people that come out for the trip. I mean, this trip was really designed for people who are new to bicycle touring. And a lot of the people who do come on the tour are completely new to bike touring. They've either never done a multi-day bike ride before, they've never camped before, or some combination of the two. There are also a lot of people who come out who are experienced bicycle travelers, but are just looking for a new experience. They want to go somewhere new, they want to meet new people. So there's a wide range of people who come out for this Bikes and Burritos overnight bicycle tour. In fact, if this looks like the type of bike tour that you might enjoy, you might consider joining us on one of our future bike rides. To learn more about the future Bicycle Terrain Pro tours that are on offer, please click the link down below. I'll put a link in the video description as well. Uh, just go to my website, bicycleterrainpro.com forward slash calendar, and you will see a list of all of the upcoming bike tours that you are welcome to join. In fact, there is another Bikes and Burritos overnight bike tour coming up in Park City, Utah in September, September 17th and 18th. So if you are in the area or you're willing to travel here, uh, it's a great place to come for a week-long vacation or something like that, consider signing up. Once again, the dates are September 17th and 18th, coming up here in the year of 2022. If this looks like the type of bike tour that you might enjoy, there are a few spots remaining, although I assume these spots will fill quickly as the tour dates get closer and closer. All right, once again, I am Darren Alf from BicycleTouringPro.com. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you out on the road sometime soon, maybe on the Bikes and Burritos Overnight Bicycle Tour, September 17th and 18th in Park City, Utah. Hope to see you then. Bye-bye.